Hiya, my name's Hayley Smitten. I am the events manager at Grand Central Hall. What isn't Grand Central, to be honest with you? I take care of the dome, which we call the dome, that's the theatre, that's in Grand Central. But we've also got a 46 bedroom hotel. We've also got the Liffey, the Barcelona bar Racine, and then seven bars within one bar. So it is, you've got to see it to believe it, the amount of stuff that goes on there. It's, it's unique to Liverpool. Nowhere else in Liverpool has got what we've got. The history, I believe that uh, Grand Central Hall's been there since 1905. The, the dome, the theatre space, that was a Methodist church originally, um, which we still have the original organ and it still works. Um, and it's been all kinds. It's been a dance hall, it's been a dole office. It's, it's been all kinds. And then the theatre was abandoned for years and years and years. And then down the stairs where all them bars are was the Barcelona, the iconic Barcelona bar. And then it went to Quiggins. And there's, lo there's loads of history in the building. Um, we've got Roscoe Gardens attached to the theatre, so when you come in from Mount Pleasant, you come through Roscoe Gardens. That's got William Roscoe buried in. It's got his grave there, and he was greatly associated with freeing the slaves in Liverpool and all that. So the history in the building is just immense. From start to finish is unique. Uh, whether you're coming to see a show in the Dome, or you're going down to Smoky Moe's, or you go in the Barcelona or the Liffey. I mean, obviously, as a the Liffey Sundays, you know, Liffey Sundays are just wild and then you can go into the dome and you can enjoy a full cabaret experience and then you can go down to stairs to smoky mo's and shaky shimmy there's there's so much everyone starts off really classy and sophisticated and then we send you packing with a lovely hangover and boss memories oh, i couldn't ask for better employers to be honest with you i really couldn't and reiterating what I've just said it's a, it's it's not just a team it's a family like Maureen is one of the most loveliest people I've ever come across to work for like I've always been quite lucky with employees but Maureen straight away she's taking you under that wing and considering that you know she's been in the business for so long as she has she's still really hands-on she still loves it she still gets a buzz out of it and then in turn, that's a knock-on effect and you get the buzz out of your job and it's just, it's just great. Well, I'm really excited to tell you we've just launched our brand new website. So it's grandcentralhall.com. Everything you need to know is on there. You can sign up for our what's on and info page show. And then if you sign up for that, you'll, you receive our offers and first dibs on tickets. So we will release them to like our VIP customers first and then you get first first pick if you like because sh the shows are going to fly out uh, we're on twitter instagram we've got grand central hall liverpool we've got liverpool grand central hall we've got grand central hall cinema club because we're just so because we've got the big screen there we're just starting cinema clubs so showing all the cult films the classics and all that on the screen so yeah and you can give us a call on 709 3559 as well that's our box office number as well Hilarious. <laughs> um, bossy and fun. I surround myself with um, positive, no drama people. Like, don't get me wrong, I'm not like all oh, this, oh, hippie love, but I just mean just simple people who want to go out and just have fun or enjoy doing the simple things and that you can just barely laugh with, really. Actually at university as well, so I don't really have much spare time. But when I do get some spare time, I do really love um, spending time with my little nephew because he's just a little belter. But I love the theatre as well. I helped produce a show at the Empire um, a few years ago. You know, 1,500 people there, a variety show. And then the people that were on that, um, I've also done bits of acting. Um, I, yeah, do you know what? I've had some really... I've had some really good moments, I can't pinpoint them all, and I've been lucky along the way for the people that I've met as well. I've met some really, I've met some Liverpool legends. I worked with Doddy a few times before he passed away. So yeah, you know, yeah. I think the people I've met along the way. Do you know what, this is gonna sound really boring, and it's not really a hobby. 
Well, the, I love walking my dog on Crosby Beach, right? I love walking my dog on Crosby Beach. But I like writing um, short stories and plays as well. So, yeah, so. But I only do that when I have an hour. But, yeah, I like to do that. It costs nothing to be nice. That, that, that bit of advice was given to me years ago, and I just remember that. And it doesn't cost nothing to be nice. Oh, can they be fictional? Oh, then. I have Michael from The Godfather. Because, you know, The Godfather's iconic. Uh, Nelson Mandela, because, legend. Um, Tom Hardy, just because. It's Tom Hardy. Mm. I best get a girl in there, hadn't I? Just to, just to, just to balance it up. Um, and my mum. Uh, firstly, downtown's connections are just immense. They've sent us in so many right directions and they're now nationwide. It's, it's the obvious choice.